New Google Stitch update is insane. Today I'm going to show you the brand new Google Stitch update that just dropped. This thing is a total game changer for anyone building websites or apps. It's so easy a kid could use it and I'm going to show you exactly how to use it to grow your business starting right now. Let's go. So Google just changed everything with this new Stitch update and most people have no idea this even happened. But if you're building anything online, you need to know about this right now. Because this update makes it insanely easy to preview and share your Gemini creations. And I'm talking like stupid easy, the kind of easy way you don't need to be a tech genius to use it. Here's what happened. Google released Stitch with Gemini 3 and the response was huge. People were going crazy over it, building websites, apps, landing pages, all kinds of stuff. But there was one problem. Sharing your creations was kind of annoying. You had to jump through hoops. You had to do extra steps. It wasn't clean. So Google listened and they just dropped this update that fixes everything. Now you can click any screen you create and it opens in a standalone tab, just like that. One click and suddenly your design comes alive. It's sitting there in its own window, ready to share, ready to show to clients, ready to use. Hey, if we haven't met already, I'm the digital avatar of Julian Goldie, CEO of SEO agency, Goldie Agency. Whilst he's helping clients get more leads and customers, I'm here to help you get the latest AI updates. Julian Goldie reads every comment, so make sure you comment below. Let me explain why this matters. When you're building something in Stitch, you're using AI to create real websites and apps, not fake mockups, not screenshots, real working code. But before this update, when you wanted to show someone what you built, it was stuck inside the Stitch interface. You couldn't easily pull it out and say, hey, look at this thing I made. You couldn't send a clean link to a client. You couldn't test it like a real website. Now you can, and that changes everything. Because now when you build something with Stitch, it's not just a project in a tool. It's a real thing you can use, a real thing you can share, a real thing you can show off. Here's how this works in practice. Let's say you're building a new landing page for the AI Profit Boardroom. You want to create a page that converts, a page that shows the amazing value of AI automation, a page that explains all the benefits of the community, a page that gets more customers, leads, and traffic. So you go into Stitch, you tell Gemini what you want. You say, create a landing page for the AI Profit Boardroom that highlights how businesses can save hundreds of hours with AI automation and get access to a community of experts. Gemini builds it right there in seconds. You see the design taking shape, the colors, the layout, the copy, everything. And here's where the new update comes in. Before you'd be looking at this landing page inside the Stitch window, it's there, it looks good, but it's not real yet. Now you just click on that screen, one click and boom, it opens in its own tab. Now you're looking at it like a real website. You can scroll, you can click buttons, you can test the forms. You can see how it actually works. Now, if you want to dive even deeper into AI automation, I've got something special for you. I run a community called the AI Profit Boardroom, the best place to scale your business, get more customers and save hundreds with AI automation. Learn how to save time and automate your business with AI tools like Google Stitch. The link is in the comments and description. And you know what else you can do? You can copy that link and send it to anyone, your team, your clients, your friends, anyone. And they see the exact same thing you see. A real working landing page, not a screenshot, not a mock-up, the real deal. This is massive for anyone running a business because now you can prototype ideas faster than ever. You can test new pages. You can show clients options. You can build and share in minutes instead of days. And you don't need a developer, you don't need a designer, you just need Stitch and this new update. Let me give you another example. Let's say you want to build a sign-up page for a new AI workshop. You want people to join, you want to collect emails, you want it to look professional. You could spend hours in some website builder, or you could spend days waiting for a developer, or you could just tell Stitch what you want, build it in two minutes, click to open it in a new tab, and send that link out to your audience. That's the power here, speed, simplicity. And now with this update, you get shareability on top of it. You get the ability to take your AI creations and actually use them in the real world, not just look at them, use them. Now, let me tell you what this means for the future, because this isn't just about one update. This is about where AI is going. We're moving into a world where you don't need to know how to code to build websites. You don't need to understand CSS or HTML or JavaScript. You just need to know what you want and AI builds it for you and tools like Stitch are leading the way. They're making it easier. They're making it faster. They're making it accessible to everyone. Not just developers, not just tech people, everyone. But here's the thing most people miss. Having the tool isn't enough. You need to know how to use it. You need to understand how to write good prompts. You need to know how to test your designs. 
you need to know how to optimize for conversions, and that's where most people get stuck. They have access to amazing AI tools, but they don't know how to use them to actually grow their business. They build stuff, but it doesn't convert. They create pages, but they don't get traffic. They have the technology, but they don't have the strategy. All right, let's keep going because I want to show you some specific ways you can use this new Stitch update right now. Real practical stuff you can do today. First way, client presentations. If you're a freelancer or you run an agency, this is gold. You can build mockups for clients in minutes. And now with this update, you can send them a real link. They click it, they see a real website, not a PDF, not a screenshot, a real work in sight. That makes you look way more professional and it makes it way easier for clients to say yes. Second way, testing ideas fast. You have an idea for a new product or a new service or a new offer. You want to test it, see if people are interested. Before this, you'd have to build a whole landing page, get a developer, wait days. Now you just build it in Stitch, open it in a new tab, send the link to your email list, see who clicks, see who signs up, test your idea in hours instead of weeks. Third way, build in internal tools. Maybe you need a simple dashboard for your team or a form for collecting data or a page for tracking something. You could pay for a fancy tool or you could just build it yourself in Stitch, open it in a tab, share it with your team. Done. Fourth way, creating lead magnets. You want to give away something valuable to grow your email list, a checklist, a template, a resource page, build it in Stitch, make it look amazing, open it in a new tab. Now you have a real lead magnet you can share and it took you 10 minutes. Fifth way, rapid prototyping. You're building a bigger project, a full website, an app, whatever. You want to test different layouts, different designs, different flows, build multiple versions in Stitch, open each one in its own tab, compare them side by side, see which one works best, then use that as your blueprint. These are just five ways, but there are hundreds more. The point is this, with this new update, Stitch becomes way more useful because now your creations aren't trapped in the tool. They're real things you can use, real things you can share, real things you can test. And here's something else people don't talk about enough. The speed of iteration, when you can build and share this fast, you can try more things, you can test more ideas, you can fail faster, and failing faster means learning faster, which means growing faster. Most people spend weeks on one idea, they build it perfect, they polish it, they make it beautiful, and then they launch it and it doesn't work. And they wasted weeks when you can build and test in hours. You can try 10 ideas in the time it used to take to try one, and one of those 10 is going to work. That's how you win. Now, let me talk about something important, quality. Because some people think AI tools make bad stuff. They think it's going to look cheap or broken or unprofessional. And yeah, if you don't know what you're doing, that can happen. But if you know how to write good prompts, if you know how to guide the AI, and it took you minutes, the secret is in the details. You can't just say, build me a website. You need to be specific. You need to tell it what you want, what colors, what style, what sections, what copy. The more specific you are, the better the output. And with Gemini 3 powering Stitch, the output is already really good. You just need to guide it right. For example, if you're building that AI profit boardroom landing page, you don't just say make a landing page. You say create a modern landing page for the AI profit boardroom with a bold headline about saving time with AI automation, three benefit sections showing how businesses can get more customers with AI tools, social proof from community members, and a clear call to action button to join the community. Make it clean, professional, and use blue and white colors. See the difference? That's going to give you something way better something you can actually use, something that actually converts. And now with this update, you can share that with anyone. You can show your team, you can show potential customers, you can use it as your actual landing page if you want, that's the power. Let me tell you what this means for the next few years, because this is just the beginning. Right now, Stitch lets you build websites and apps with AI, and this update makes them easier to share. But in a year, two years, these tools are going to be 10 times better. They're going to understand context better. They're going to create more complex things. They're going to integrate with more platforms. We're heading toward a world where you can say, I want a full e-commerce store that sells AI automation courses with payment processing and email automation. And Gemini just builds it, all of it in minutes. And you can open it in a tab and start using it right away. That's where we're going. And, and the people who learn how to use these tools now are going to have a massive advantage because they'll understand how to work with AI. They'll know the patterns, they'll know the prompts, they'll know the strategies, and everyone else will be playing catch up. That's why I'm so focused on teaching this stuff. That's why the AI Profit Boardroom exists, because I see where this is going, and I want to make sure you're ready. I want to make sure you know how to use these tools to actually build something, not just play around, actually build. Now, if you want to dive even deeper into AI automation, I've got something special for you. I run a community called the AI Profit Boardroom. 
the best place to scale your business, get more customers and save hundreds with AI automation. Learn how to save time and automate your business with AI tools like Google Stitch. And if you want the full process, SOPs and 100 plus AI use cases like this one, join the AI Success Lab. You'll get all the video notes from there, plus access to our community of 45,000 members who are crushing it with AI. The link is in the comments and description.